hello there. I just finished reading the first three Friday Barnes books. The first book, Friday Barnes, Go Detective. When Friday um, solves the mystery of a bank robbery, um, she spends her reward money to go to Highcrest Academy, which is the top school in Australia. But everything isn't quite as it seems. There are lots of mysteries um, where Friday Bond's girl detective can solve easily. But then she meets the case of the Swamp Yeti. Can Friday solve this? I'm going to leave that to you to find out. Book 2, uh, Friday Barnes Under Suspicion. So, uh, Friday Barnes um, sold the uh, Swamp Yeti case easily. But then, strange holes seem to be peering all over the school field. Why are these strange holes appearing? Friday Bonds will have to figure that out soon. And also, Friday Bonds has been placed under arrest. Does that have anything to do with the um, holes in school field? Or does anyone she meets have anything to do with the holes in the school field? Who knows? And I'm not going to tell you because that will ruin it. Book 3, Friday Barnes Big Trouble Friday's dad appears in the middle of a lesson and tells Friday some horrible news. Her mother has been kidnapped. But the headmaster also needs Friday's detective knowledge because Princess Ingrid of Norway is um, coming to Highcrest Academy. But even with all the security measures, things start to go missing. Can Friday Barnes solve the case of the Pimpernel? If not, then she's in big trouble. I really loved all three of these books and I really recommend them. My favourite character is definitely Friday Barnes, the main character in all of the Friday Barnes books because I think that her detective knowledge is amazing plus I love her hat. Look, it's there. It's amazing. Um, it's, the books are set in Australia because the author, R.A. Spratt, um, is Australian. Um, and I give these books definitely a 5 out of 5. That's all from me today. Bye!